This will be for the kind exercise combining like terms with negative coefficients and distribution. So the two steps involved here, number one is to use the distributive property. And then once you do that, step two is to combine like terms. All right, you wanna remember that a positive times a negative will give you a negative, and a negative times a negative will give you a positive. All right, so we have our expression we wanna simplify. The first step is to use the distributive property. So we distribute this two to both terms. We're gonna multiply both of these terms by two. So first two times negative two will give us negative four. And then two times negative four P will give us negative eight P. All right, because two times negative four is negative eight and you keep the P. Same thing here. We have two times negative 2p, 2 times negative 2 is negative 4, and you keep the p, and then 2 times negative 1 is just negative 2. Alright, combining like terms, look for the ones with letters first. We have negative 8p and negative 4p. Negative 8 minus 4 is negative 12 and you want to keep the P and then the terms without letters negative 4 minus 2 is negative 6 so that's our final answer the order of the terms does not really matter but usually you put the one with the variable first and these are multiple choice let's look for negative 12 P minus 6 okay answer A All right, we want to simplify this here. And if you'll notice, there's no number or coefficient in front of this variable. And when that occurs, you can just automatically write in a one. So since this was negative x, it's really just negative one x, same thing. All right, so we have the eight. The eight is not being distributive. So I'm gonna keep the eight for now. And then distributing negative four times negative 1x. Well, negative 4 times negative 1 is positive 4. And we keep the x. And then negative 4 times positive 5 is negative 20. Okay, now we can combine like terms. Do the letters or variables first. There's 4x, and that's the only term with x, so we just keep that. And then the ones without letters, we have 8 minus 20. So 8 minus 20 is just negative 12. Final answer, 4x minus 12. And it just happened to be answer A. All right, one more you want to distribute first. And by the way, here we have a negative n. You can make that negative 1n. All right, so distributing 2 times negative 1n, 2 times negative 1 is negative 2, and we keep the n, and then distribute 2 times negative 3, that's negative 6. Okay, next section here, we have negative 7 times positive 5, that's negative 35, and then we have negative 7 times positive 2n. Negative 7 times positive 2 is negative 14, but you keep the n. All right. Now let's do the letters or variables first. We have negative 2 and negative 14n. So negative 2n minus 14n, that's negative 16n. And then the ones without letters, negative 6 minus 35, that's negative 41. Okay, you can use your calculator if you're not sure. Final answer, let's look for negative 16n minus 41. Answer B. 
Okay, so notice all their answer choices have the letter or variable written first. So when you combine like terms, I would do the ones with the letters first, followed by the ones without letters.